In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how you can integrate Shopify with Flowdesk. So what you need to do, you need to be signed in on your Shopify account on a browser and also with Flowdesk. So what you want to do then, you want to go to the link in the description or search for Sapir yourself. Here it is, Sapir, and this is an integration tool where you can connect different platforms with each other. So we can create this app right now and let me explain this. We can set a trigger on, for example, Shopify. That's what we're going to do now. And then something is going to happen automatically on Flowdesk. That's what we're going to set up. So let's type in Shopify right here. Choose an event. So let's say a new paid order. So when someone pays for a product on your site, something is going to happen on Flowdesk. And that's what we're going to set up. Let's hit connect right here. Choose your account or sign in with your account. I've already done that. You can just hit connect account, sign in with your Shopify information, really easy. Then we can go to action and we can type in flow desk, just like that. Now we can choose an event and we can basically set an event right here. So when the new paid order is fulfilled in Shopify, we can select what is going to happen next in flow desk. So let's say add uh, create slash update subscriber. So we can do that, hit continue. We can sign in with a flow desk account and we can start setting this up and make this work with Sapir. So that's why I like Sapir. We can, um, so now when someone pays on our Shopify store, a new uh, subscriber will be created in our Flowdesk account. If this helped you out, please leave a like, please subscribe and see you next time. Have a good day.